Hello and welcome. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to find the inverse of a 2x2 two two matrix. So let's say we have the matrix A, which is equal to 2, 4, negative 1, and 7. So when we find the inverse, we label it as whatever you labeled the original matrix to the power of negative 1. So in this case, our inverse will be A to the negative 1. Now, one thing to note when finding the inverse is that the elements in your matrix relate to different letters. So our 2 relates to A, our 4 relates to B, and so on. So it's just A, B, C, and D. Now that we know that, we can have a look at the formula to find the inverse of a matrix. So that rule to find the inverse of a matrix is 1 over AD minus BC times the matrix D negative B negative C and A. So this is the rule we're going to use to find the inverse of every 2 by 2 matrix. That's an important part. This only works for 2 by 2 matrix matrices. 3 times 3 or larger will have a different method. But usually if you're going to do it by hand, they're going to give you a 2x2 two two matrix and you will use this rule. So let's do this for our example. So a to the power of minus 1 or our inverse of our matrix is equal to 1 over our a times d. That's 2 times 7 minus our b times c which is 4 times negative 1. And we're going to multiply all that by a matrix and we're going to swap A and D around. So that becomes 7 and 2. And then we're going to make B and C the same, but we're going to flip the sign. So we're going to multiply it by negative 1. So 4 becomes minus 4, and negative 1 becomes 1. Now we're going to continue working to simplify this. So 2 times 7 is 14, and 4 times negative 1 is negative 4. So 14 minus negative 4 Remember, 2 negatives makes a positive, so it becomes 14 plus 4, which is 18. And we're going to multiply that by that same matrix, so nothing there has changed. And this is an okay answer, but usually you're going to want to multiply these together, so you get your inverse as one matrix. So if we do that, we get 1 over 18 times 7, which is just 7 over 18. And then 1 over 18 times negative 4, so that's negative 4 over 18. And if we continue, we get 1 over 18 and 2 over 18. So it seems like we're done, but the final thing you're going to want to do is simplify this, and then you will have the best answer possible. So if we simplify this, we will get our inverse of A, and that will give us 7 over 18, so that can't be simplified. But negative 4 over 18 can be, as they can both be divided by 2 to give us negative 2 over 9. Now I'll just zoom out a little and continue. So 1 over 18 stays as 1 over 18 and 2 over 18. Both numbers can be divided by 2 to give us 1 over 9. And that is our fully simplified answer. So you just learned how to find the inverse of a matrix. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing, and I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Bye!